Video 6, the human canaria, canary, the myth of vitamin C as a treatment for colds and cancer. Once research has been published, then popularised by the press and other media outlets, it often becomes incorporated into a belief common to many, a belief which is very difficult to eradicate. An example may be the work of Linus Pauling, there is no suggestion Pauling deliberately falsified any data. He is widely respected through many scientific communities and remains the only person to be awarded two unshared Nobel Prizes. His work on chemical bonding marks him as one of the founders of modern quantum chemistry. However, he had an almost obsessive respect for the efficacy of vitamin C preparations in a variety of clinical settings as a treatment for cancer and as a way to prevent the common cold. His claims of treatment success were never confirmed by clinical trials conducted by such institutions as the Mayo Clinic, which found vitamin C was no better than a placebo at treating cancers. Other researchers in reputable institutions using well-designed studies, have also confirmed the Mayo Clinic's findings. Pauling refused to accept such findings and continued to promote vitamin C as a cancer treatment until his death. Because of his name, which was then and still is, widely respected for his other works in biochemistry, quantum chemistry, and molecular biology, the myth of vitamin C as a cure-all for heart disease, arteriosclerosis, the common cold, cancer, etc., and his promotion of orthomolecular therapy still lingers as a viable treatment in the popular press, as the following articles would seem to confirm. Scientific proof. You can prevent cancer with vitamin C. Laurie Alton, January 9th, 2015, in Natural Health. The article states, there is also strong indication that vitamin C supplementation and vitamin C rich foods can protect against and treat cervical, rectal, breast and even lung cancers. This belief is not part of mainstream medical theory. The Natural Health article cites evidence of research by Linus Pauling and others of the efficacy of vitamin C therapy. Unfortunately, Linus Pauling died of prostatic carcinoma in August 1994 and sought radiation therapy for his condition. What the Natural Health article fails to mention are the numerous well-designed studies which have dismissed completely any link between ingestion of vitamin C and its effect on the common cold or indeed any form of cancer. Please hit the subscribe button if you want to continue to dispel the myths surrounding medicine. It's a little image of a Neanderthal on the bottom right of your screen. Also, please indicate whether you like or dislike this video.